Hello everybody, I'm here at the Shivananda Ashram with Celine and she is such an amazing soul and I wanted to ask her, she has so much uh, of that female power energy, it's like uh, when I saw her the first time I was just blown away and she's so powerful, um, how do you kind of getting this power and connection? Through the womb, <laughs> through the womb and through the heart, through connecting with the elements, through connecting with my ancestors, and with everything. Was it always that way, or when did you discover your your power and your soul connection, and that it's important to connect with your soul? It definitely wasn't always like that, um, but I think when I started to search for more meaning in life um, and I started working with my healer, the sticker won't stick, <laughs> do it with love. <laughs> When I started to work energetically with my body and with everything around, I think I started to build a connection with my yoni, with my heart, and um, since then we just go deeper and deeper and go deeper into the layers that we've created over time. What would you tell um, to the people like uh, your generation, uh, the non-believers, the more uh, rational people, um, how to become a believer, how to connect? What can they learn from you? How can you invite them? I think the best invitation is by embodying what I want to see in the, in the world, by becoming the love that I want to see, by embodying that love and embodying myself. I think this is the best I can do. I, I do not feel that it is my responsibility to actively go out in the world and tell people how they should live their life. I think you live by experience. You have to go out and try new things and be courageous and especially do the things that scare you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but definitely also listen to whatever feels good to you, whatever your heart desires, whatever feels true to you, not to anyone else. I could tell you how you should live your life, but that's based on my experience and your experience is a different experience. So yeah, I think just go out and try new things and explore. The world has so much to explore so many new places and new people and new animals and new plants and so much beauty and if you go out there you will start to see and recognize everywhere God you will recognize God everywhere you look so that's basically <laughs> what you can cool. do <laughs> so thank you everybody just listen to the words of her heart, um, connect yourself, go out of your box and discover life. Thank you. Bye bye. Ciao.